Welcome back everybody and today we're going to be talking about um, kind of what's going to be happening with the new uh, PTR coming out in January. So I believe it's going to come up in the beginning of January. We ha have to kind of see maybe later tonight or tomorrow we'll have more news or if not it's going to be definitely next week after the winter convergence is over it's probably going to be having some release of that probably most likely but we have to see so i'll go a little bit more into depth with that and then uh second uh and lastly we're going to be talking about what's going to be happening with the channel and kind of like the future of it so first i'm going to talk about the channel and uh i hope you guys first off had a good new year's and also christmas and now um i hope it was really really good so i hope that was uh, good New Year's for you guys. So we're going to be talking about kind of like what is going to be happening with this channel. We are going to be posting some new videos very, very soon. Uh, kind of like a Five Nights at Freddy's. Um, and when the Sons of the Forest 2 releases, we're going to be posting some of that. And maybe some like um, some more survival games and like more zombie games or something like that. I'll be posting some of that stuff. So um, more like kind of like open world stuff as well. So uh, that is going to be coming to this channel. So make sure you guys uh, subscribe to that. And as well as that, uh, we added a new Patreon account and a few new links as well. So you guys can support us just by uh, clicking on there. Uh, we are posting some guide videos and also some like um, new videos as well. So that has not been released on my channel yet. So you guys can get a kind of like early access stuff. Um, so uh, on there, so you guys can check the link on the description. And next we're gonna be talking about uh, pretty much the PTR. So. Currently, I'm getting ready for like the PTR and stuff like that, and uh, basically been saving a lot of resources. So um, you can see I just made 12k right there, and the 12k was probably selling a trophy most likely. Uh, yeah, uh, so basically I sold another trophy, and like I was saying, um, I'm stocking up on this, and I'm buying a lot of the stuff, I'm trying to be the top uh, buy order. So you can see I have a lot of buy orders. So. Um, just making a lot of gold just i'm not even playing the game really um i'm like maybe putting like 20 minutes in just because i have to do buy orders and somebody is always outbidding me so i'm always doing a lot of buy orders so you can just see right here i'm doing a lot i pretty sure somebody might have done another buy order here because this would have sold already so i have to go double check on that but i'm doing a lot of buy orders and basically you guys can kind of see what i'm stocking up on um this is all what i'm stocking up on um i do think ironhide is probably going to shoot up in price very soon um this is <laughs> ironhide is definitely going to be the long longer game by far but it's definitely going to be the most profitable one by far um so i'm hoping hopefully people will start buying the stuff and like um upgrading their leather working and just you you know really just hammer on that and using cooldowns so that way it could go up but this is definitely the iron the iron hide is definitely the long-term game even if it doesn't go up more than like 20 cents i'm still profiting like significantly so um i bought this for 12 uh one to three cents and so that's it and i i think i have more than enough now i have like 150,000 of these iron hides so we'll see what happens but uh yeah um and like I'm stacking up on platinum and stuff like that. This is the price I'm selling it for. Uh, I, I don't want people to touch this. Like this is like for me for like crafting something else. So um, usually I don't want people to touch this, but if it sells, it sells. That would be really, really good. But uh, I do think platinum is going to be pretty decent as uh, the reason why is because star metal is usually very, very overpriced. Like I think it's like 20, uh, 20 gold per ingot. So um, I got this for like, uh, three gold so i think that's pretty profitable um like nine gold to make um was it the orcal ingots you know those are very very like th that's what i'm using these for like orcal ingots some of them i have them on um the trading post just because i want it on there uh because like uh just because of the weight reasons and maybe of myself by the time I get to this and start crafting, right? The ingots. So um, I also got a lot of Orcal Ores and Platinum and stuff like that because I want to craft the Platinum stuff and, as well. And yeah, you kind of see like what I've been stocking up on. And um, yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing. I'm also stocking up on uh, buy orders. So crafting trophies, that's the number one thing I'm usually stocking up on. Uh, as you can see, 14,000, that's like 20,000 worth of uh, gold just on trophy mats and the stocking a lot on that so um stocking a little bit more on platinum and i noticed that this is already not selling because somebody else is uh, bidding me so that's kind of frustrating so um but platinum is going to be very very king um yeah this is really uh, 
pricey now. So oh, I might not buy that, that much plan. I really have to see. So um, I have to do a little bit of math and just see if this is going to be worth it. Uh, right now, this is really cheap. This was going for a gold. Now it's down to like 40 cents and then it's going up to gold again. So it's like it's back and forth. So you, just, you I make a little bit of I buy a little bit of it. And like, that's not too bad, right? Same with gold. I'm trying to buy some gold as well. It's just because like sometimes farming the matches is just a little bit too long. So that's kind of what I'm stocking up on, what um, I'm looking out for on my server. So mind you guys, when on when you guys are on your server, you have to uh, basically do things accordingly. Um, but I do find like those mats, like any legendary stuff is going to sell for quite a bit. Um, in the beginning, it's not going to sell that much just because everyone's like offloading all their stuff right now. So it's not going to be profitable in the beginning. But uh, like, oopsies, I have to flip this around. Like. This was like selling for like 70 cents, you know, can make some profits on there. Uh, pure solvent, uh, really good time to actually stock up on this because like you could just see the volumes drying up. You know, there's definitely going to be a push like a lot higher, you know, and people will definitely buy some of that. Um, I actually might just buy some of this because I might um, level up my furnishing. I probably might try that out, but there's no point because these guys are not smart uh, buy order guys because they have it for way too high uh, two pennies you might as well just buy it out you might as well just buy these guys out for two pennies right if it was like 30 cents yeah i would put a buy order for that but like you know if it's at the ask, asking price there's no no there's no point to do buy order and stuff like that and just wastes some um, order space so yeah stuff like that resources rare resources like they do take a, a while for them to start shooting up in price. Remind, like, just to remind you guys, like uh, I was talking about this yesterday, where it was like selling for 13 gold. Now it's getting close to 20 gold, and it's just gonna go up and up and up. Um, ironwood is going up and up and up in pricing, um, slowly but surely. It's gonna go up. So that's kind of like what I'm suggesting. Um, I have a feeling they might do a patch nerf on uh, these these uh boxes so what i'm probably gonna do is like i have a ton of them so what i'm probably gonna do is like i'm probably gonna open all of these boxes and didn't like store them in the, like a place that i don't go to like probably like reek water right now or like weaver's fan or something like that or probably like the shores uh just because like this is gonna weigh too much so i do think i'm gonna open this all these up today and make another video just showing you guys like hey i'm just opening you know, but you can see how much you you can get from all these uh, uh high tier stuff right so um yeah, i'll make a video on that stuff so yeah that's kind of like the thing i'm going to be looking for is just like same things just looking for rare resources and hides and stuff like that because they'll definitely start going up in pricing um i'm thinking to like if this was the lower price like this was like going for like 30 cents i got some of those i did a buy order and uh yeah they're currently pretty pricey right now but um raw hides so a really good price actually um but there's a lot of people doing buy orders for that for like five cents so not worth it um yeah so basically that's what i'm gonna be doing so other than that i will keep posting more videos and stuff like that so stay tuned for new content as well so make sure you hit the subscribe button hit the bell notification because we're always posting new tips trick and guy videos and uh new content as well so make sure you guys check the links below i have like new videos on there that you guys can get early access to before i start posting them on my real page so uh check that out and other than that um yeah uh, on that, uh, take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.